Hey, hello, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Shelly and today we're gonna do a bit different. We're gonna do something different with the, this month's TBR. So I thought I'd do things a bit differently this month with my TBR. As in, I've uh, picked up a random wheel generator and put in all my own red books. So, according to Goodreads, I have 151 unread books. Now, I only have 74 entries in this random wheel generator, and let me explain why. So, there are certain books that already has the month of to be read, so I've not entered those. I've also not entered full series, I've only entered the first book in a series. Kind of makes sense, right? I've also not entered any Christmas books because I'm kind of thinking I might do like some Christmas books reading thing over in December for Bookmas. <laughs> Cheesy plug. Um, what else? I've also not entered any classics because I'm not in the classics mood. You need a special mood to enter the classics and I'm not it. I'm not at it I'm not in it I'm not in it I'm not in that mood <laughs> so I have decided that I will pick five TBR books however for the month of July I already have two picks already picked out and we can blame Val and Cage for both of these no not really but before we started our book club last year, we kind of buddy read, what's it called? Red Rising, that's what it's called. So, yeah, we, we, we thought we'd pick this one up, Iron Gold by Pierce Brown. Um, I had this on my TBR earlier this year as well, which I never picked up uh, for many reasons, but yeah. So, we decided that July would be the month we pick up this book. Uh, I'm not really looking forward to it, let's be honest, because I hear there's multiple perspectives in this and I was kind of just enjoying how Red Rising was going. Um, but we shall be picking this one up and as we are all buddy reading it, it will hopefully be read. <laughs> The other book that is also a partly Val and Katie's fault, it's not really, but it's part of our book club. So it's Warbreaker by Brandon Sandinson. So I had first thought to uh, read all, if not at least one, <laughs> of the Miss Bond books before I picked one, picked this one up. Um, I've, I've not. I've barely made a dent in the first Miss Bond book so I suppose I will be reading this one before I read Miss Bond. It can happen, it can happen. Okay, so that leaves three picks for the random wheel generator which uh, I'm, I'm, I'm a little scared about, I'm, I'm not gonna lie, yeah, yep, 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 yep. So, Let's put it up on the screen and let's cry afterwards. So let's just spin this wheel and see what happens, shall we? Because it's, it's the only way it's gonna... Yeah. We can deal with it. We, we can do it. We can do this. Yes, yes, yes. Diaries. Cool. Where do we have you? I'm back. So, The Carrie Diaries by Candace Bushnell. So this is a prequel to Sex and the City. So Carrie Bradshaw as a teen. Okay. For pick number two. So, for 
pick number two we have Summer at Shell Cottage by Alozi Diamond. Okay, on to book pick number three. So for book pick number three, we have Lucy in the Sky by Paige Toon. Um, is this her first book? I think this is her first book. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Interesting. 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 Let's see. So for the TBR picks for the month of July, we have... Iron Gold by Pierce Brown, we have Warbreaker by Bandon Sanderson, we have The Carry Diaries by Candish Bushnell, Summer at Shell Cottage by Lucy Diamond, and Lucy in the Sky by Paige Toon. So, um, contemporary winning, <laughs> contemporary winning out on this pick, but it is to be expected seeing as I think I have mostly contemporary unread books not gonna lie um yeah well yeah well that is sure to be a interesting month i suppose and i don't think i have anything more to say so let me just say thank you so much for watching uh until next time take care oh, bye bye